How's it going guys? I'm gonna show you guys a quick little way to fix the glove box dash lift on my JZX90 Cresta. Um, yeah, so I've never done this before. I didn't look it up or anything like that. It's either gonna go along good or be absolutely horrible. Um, here's the car. I'll show more details about it in another video. It's just been bugging me really bad and I would love to get this fixed because it is very hot right now. So I'm gonna show you guys just kind of like a step-by-step -step on what I'm doing. It may not be the proper way to do it, but it's the way that I'm gonna attempt to do it because there's zero videos online. So let's see how this goes. So this is probably, again, other cars may not have this issue. The ones I looked up online, it looks like they all did this. Um, Obviously, the glove box comes down. It looks like it just came out of this, this lip. Because if you were to press it back in, it goes back in. Um, but it's definitely lifting. There's a plastic up in there. It looks like someone's may have tried to do it before as well. Um, so I'm going to try to remove this box, get this glued down, and then the box, when it comes in, will press right up against this lip needs to be touching that edge. A few things you have to do. There are two little clips that look like this. You pop these out, the little tab right there. There's two screws behind it. Everyone should be able to see that. And then there's these style pins. Basically how it works is you press the center in all the way and that releases it. From there, what I did was I just pulled on this a little bit, pulled on this a little bit just to get it back and out of the groove. And then I'm gonna either try to pull this whole assembly out so I can get a bunch of glue up behind this, or I'm just gonna pull it enough to where I can get some glue up in there, then clamp this down, let it sit, then push all this back in. So what I'm gonna use to get the dash down to the plastic lining on the inside it's gonna be this E6000. I couldn't find anything at Home Depot that was safe on rubber um, and plastic to like bond them together. So I'm hoping that this works. Again, I don't know, but the dash is pulled out a little bit. I don't know how this whole thing comes out, but I was able to get it out just enough. I'm gonna put a bunch of this layer up underneath, just get as much as I can without obviously being too excessive, excessive over it. Um, and then get some a little bit on this lip, clamp it down, get it pushed back in. We will see how this holds. Got a bunch of the glue up underneath there. Got these clamps. I wish I would have bought one more. This area could be pressed down just a little bit more. Um, might go see if I have anything inside. But yeah, um, a little bit got on there, but I'm gonna wait for that to dry and then just scrape it off. Um, yeah, so once this all dries, get all that pushed back in. I don't know if it's going to be in the same video. It says cure times t could be 24 hours up to like 48 hours. So, yeah. And it's pretty hot outside, so I doubt it's going to cure that that fast, but that might actually help it, but we'll see. It's been about a few days later since I glued down the glove box, or the dash, dash lift. Um, yeah came out pretty good again it's not perfect like how you would have bought this car brand new i know this gap normally would have been like perfectly flush it's up a tiny bit but it's definitely not bubbly like that area is which i'm gonna have to fix another day i don't know if i gotta pull the whole dash to do that but at least this was bugging me for the most part it's uh it's good that's what that all looks like in there and I don't know how I don't know how that would go down any farther but yeah it's better than how it was it looks way 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 better so that's it for this one it was probably short we'll see how it is once it gets edited down if it just gets thrown in another another video or if it becomes its own but oh I also threw this on too no point in filming that I know not the right horn button I gotta find my vertex button. That's off the old wheel. Um, but yeah, so 
on to the next one.